Hello everyone, it's Anna here. Welcome back to my channel. Today I am making donut, pink donut. So what you're gonna need, you're gonna need two yarns, uh, one for the icing, like I'm gonna use pink for the icing, and another one for uh, pastry bottom of the uh, donut, and white one I will use for decoration. So those two yards are Aran yarns and white one is DK. Information about them I am placing in the link below the video. Uh, I am a scissors, a hook number five, marker and the needle. So let's get started. I will start from uh, icing. <laughs> All right, so what I will do, I will need to make a chain of 15. But before I start, I'm gonna leave a longer tail at the front because I will need it for stitching at the end. So I'm gonna like leave it longer. And then I start with my loop and chain of 15. All right. So it'd be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. And I will place uh, my hook in the first stitch and uh, close it with slip stitch, all right? So from here, I will make one round of a single crochet all around so it will be also 15 single crochets so it will be like it. one two three four five six Seven, okay, eight, see, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 14, 14 and the last one is 15 all right okay uh, so another round I will make three single crochets and increase so it'd be one single crochet one single crochet one single crochet and in four, it will be two single crochets, which calls increase. If you place two single crochets in one stitch, we name it increase. So I will do like this. One, two, three, and increase means two in one. Okay, and again, one, two, three and increase two in one All right and repeat again one two where is my beginning is here So it was in three and increase, and again one, two, three, and the final is increase. All right, and again from here, another row, I will make four single crochets. Oops, sorry for shake four single crochets and increase. So the same like previous, just one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
two, three, four, and increase. And again, one, two, three, four, and increase. And one, two, three, oops, again, something happened, uh, three, okay, one, two, three, four, and increase now, increase. Oh, I'm trying to make it too fast and it's coming badly. And the last one is one, two, three, four, and the final increase. Oopsie. And increase. All right. So another row. The same, just one, two, three, four, five, increase. Let's do that. One, two, three, four, five, and increase. And again, one. Yike. One. Two, three, four, five, and increase now. Increase, and again one, two, three, four five and increase and one two three four five and increase all right and the last increasing layer, it will be six single crochets and increase. So I'm making one, two, three, four, five, six, and increase. And again, one, two, three, four, five, six, and increase, and one, two, three, four, five six and the final increase and now from here i will make don't worry about this two i will make two rounds of single crochets just one single crochet in each stitch so it will be two rounds of it so i will finish my rounds of camera and you keep working on it, all right? Okay, that's how it looks like. The glaze is ready. I finished here. It's the last stitch, all right? So I will just cut the yarn, but I will leave a little bit more also the yarn because I will need to stitch top and bottom together. So I just remove the tail from here okay 
and that's my top part the glaze is ready so now make another one the same like this but with different color okay i made another part the second part they are identical how you can see they are same size so the first one i left the yarn and the second one i don't need to do that so i just cut the yarn and i will hide it inside between the stitches so i take the needle and i will just put them inside nicely So they're not gonna come out. Okay. And the same I will do with this beginning, the front one. Okay, I will flip it will be easier. can go pull it and cut all right so if I have a two parts now so what I need to do I need to stitch them together so I will start from the inner circle so I will flip both of them and take out the yarn and I will flip the other one and I will stitch them like this together so I will get my needle again. All right. Okay, 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 okay. And I will go from here. I started here. And just uh, we are stitching. Grab each one by one. All right, and then there. Okay, and we do like this all the way around. And when it's little bit gap left, you need to put our stuffing inside. Okay. Nearly there, nearly finished. Okay, let's see how it looks. All right. So now I will uh, finish this yarn. I will close it here. You can do the knot it's gonna be fine i can leave it a little bit okay and the same we need to do with the outside the ring 
so this time I can actually flip it this way and start to stitching them together the same way. Yes, so exactly there. Stitch by stitch. So in half the way, we will uh, place the uh, our uh, stuffing. So I will make probably maybe half. I will stuff a little bit here and then again close it and stuff and uh, finish, finish it off. So I will do this part of camera because it would be boring <laughs> to keep watching all the way. That's how it is. So I'm nearly half the way. I can flip it a little bit and I can put little stuffing from the one side and from another to start to having shape. and I can be finishing it this way That's how it looks. So finish stitching your donut, place your stuffing and we will make some decorations on top of it. I have to admit my donut look really tasty. Oh my, good one. All right, so now I will make a little bit of like white chocolate on top of it, right? That's gonna even look better. So I took my uh, DK yarn and I will make some chocolate lines, white chocolate on top of it. Okay, you can pick any direction, any length, any size you like. Okay, that didn't go well. <laughs> okay, it cannot go like this. I'm trying to remove it and I probably cannot. Okay, uh, what can I do? How can I save it? I need probably cut the yarn now because I couldn't get remove it from inside. 
that is bad all right okay okay i can make some one more maybe Okay, I think that would be all. Okay, and I cut my yarn at the back. If the yarn is still coming out, we can just push it with the needle inside. So you cannot see that. That's the donut is ready. I hope you enjoyed the video and if you really do, please subscribe my channel because I am publishing every week one or sometimes two new videos. So thank you for watching and see you soon. Bye!